Hello everyone, Charmaine Cena here. Okay, so I'm on Hack This Site, and I am on level 4. And if you haven't seen my other videos, I'm doing a bit of a quick video series on some walkthroughs on um, the Hack This Site missions for anyone who gets stuck. So, level 4. This time, Sam hard-coded the password into the script. However, the password is long and complex, and Sam is often forgetful, so he wrote a script that would email his password to him automatically in this case, in the case he forgot. Okay, so we have the form that we've been kind of used to now, password, um, input box with submit, and now we have uh, a send password to Sam. Okay, so first of all, I wanna see what the source code here is. So view page source. One thing that's standing out to me is it says specifically send password to send without asking for an email box. Uh, sorry, uh, an email address. So, there's, you know, I would suspect it'd be like a text box or something. So what I want to see is if there's a specific method that he's using to send uh, to his specific email. So let's do view page source. Okay, now let's see what the issue is here. We have an action, so missions slash basic for level four PHP posting. Okay, Sam at hacktosite.org is already hard coded in as a value. Okay, and when you click that button, it says send password to Sam. Okay. Well, here's the problem. Without this being uh, sanitized or sent maybe uh, as a script in the backend server, um, it's actually in the HTML code. Meaning with HTML, I can now edit this and actually inject that, uh, inject a new email address. I'll show you how. Let's go to the developer tools. Almost all modern web browsers have this. Okay. And let's search the HTML for Sam at, because I, I want to see that method for Sam at hack this site. Uh, I'm essentially looking for his email address instead of having to browse through all the elements here. Double click on that value. Okay. Now, I'm going to change this to Sean at SeanMancini.com and I'm going to hit enter. And now I'm going to click send password to send. Oh, Ponage. What happened here is that in HTML, you pretty much, um, there's no real server side action. So HTML code is very much uh, a descriptive language and nothing more. So I can actually in my browser edit a certain element and click, you know, that, that particular button. And if it's in pure HTML, that is going to be posting an HTML string into PHP. Well, if I change it within the browser, the new string is going to be sent to PHP. So PHP is none the wiser. It has no idea as to why, you know, what is being uh, sent to it. But now without this string being sanitized or without it um, being hidden in some, some way, this is what allows us to exploit this so what I'll do is I'll log into my email just to show you um, that I actually got I actually got the password so give me a moment and so here's the email that uh, I got okay. and so we see that we have um, Sam at hack this site 
sent me an email with the password. So I can take that password, go back to the main page. And boom, I just owned uh, Network Security Sam's uh, website. Now, this is almost like a, an HTML script injection where um, because the, the page is not correctly set up properly, I can inject my own strings into, um, uh, into this site almost kind of like a SQL injection would allow me to bypass uh, a, an input box that's not properly set up for invalid characters. I can bypass certain elements on your HTML page if it's not set up properly. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the comment section below. And you can also visit my website at seanmancini.com. Thank you, everyone.